welcome to itsrafik in today's video i am going to explain the most important question for practical examination for pre board and it may come in hslc also this is for html the question is this one create an html document on the topic html list and html tables the web page should contain two frames where one frame with html list and in other frame and in the other html tables means we'll have to create total three pages first page list second page table and the main page will contain both the pages let us first create the first page which will contain a simple list for that we'll go to we'll open notepad as i have already opened notepad so i can go here file new or we can do this one also control and r and here run menu will open there we can type notepad and click on okay so this notepad will open here so i will write the first part where i will create a list for that we'll write html as this page will contain inside the main page so we are not going to add head part here directly body and here we'll write about list so h2 parts of computer then h2 here we can write anything as it is not mentioned what type of list we have to create so we can do anything so i am creating here one an order list ul then li hardware li close again li software again li close again li user li close after that ol will be close and body will be closed after that the main tag html will close now we'll have to save the page for that we'll go here file save as and uh, from before uh, you will see here dot txt will be written that part you cut and choose the location where you are going to save the page as i am going to save inside desktop so desktop is selected here now we'll write the file name this file will give the name as list dot html and we'll save it okay now we'll have to create one more page which page will contain table for that we can open a new file or we can do here also i am doing in here only so we'll cut this unordered list part and here instead of parts of computer we'll write table in html and after that we'll write the command for table first table then here caption and here we'll write the table name table 1 and caption will be close caption means name of the table now we'll create a row tr and next line we'll create heading th heading 1 th will be close again th heading 2 th will be close after suppose my table contains just two columns so two time th then we'll close tr again tr here instead of th we'll write td means table data and here we'll just write 1 then td close again td 2 td close and at last tr close and for the third row again we will repeat the same thing so we can do these things we can copy this three lines and we can paste it and here we can change the number 2 3 and 4 so my html table is also created and we can do one more thing by default the table borders are hidden in html 
if we want to display the table border so we'll write table one space border equal one or whatever thickness you want that one now we'll again save the page as my this page is already saved as list so we will select save as button not save button if i click on save then the older command which i already saved in as a list that will replace with the table so we will uh, we will choose the next option save as and here i will give the name is table dot html so table i think i already have so let's replace it i have created two pages now these two pages we have to insert inside one main page using frames let's see what what pages i have created i have created this list page and i have created also one table let's see this is table this is my table now these two pages i have to insert insert inside one main page again we will open notepad here we will write we are going to create the main page first line will be doc type html then next line html then next line head then body uh, sorry title title we can give anything suppose inserting frames then title will be closed after that we will go to next line and here if we need a cs property then we can add otherwise we can skip as it is not mentioned in the question to add color and all so it is not necessary to give the colors but still for learning purposes i am doing it here suppose i want to style the page for that we will write style type text css then as we are going to do the color for the whole page so body will we are selecting body tag and background color we are setting it setting as pink then color color means the text color color i am setting as blue and margin if we want uh, let's give left margin or just skip it and break it close and style close so style parts done now we'll close the head part after closing head we will start body inside body tag we will write first h1 and here we'll write inserting frames then h1 will be close we'll go next line here we'll write i frame src equal list dot html then wide equal let it be 200 or we can give 400 any numbers it's our choice and the height we can give or we can skip i'm skipping the height take then we'll close the iframe I frame. now the same code will repeat there will insert a table so i'm copying this line and pasting it and here we'll write instead of list.html table table.html and iframe after that we can draw a line if we want or just we can close the body take body then we'll close html and remember these three pages we have to save in the same folder if we save in different folders then we'll have to give the perfect path or perfect address of the uh, that particular file and if we are saving it in same folder then just a file name is enough now we'll save this page this page will give the name is frames dot html you can give any name to this page it does not matter but remember the name to show uh, to see the output and save it 
now i'll go to the desktop this is my page let's open it so you can see here uh, there are two frames and these frames are a bit small and uh, if we make it little larger then we can do this one white we can increase we can make it 300 and also we can provide height here let the height also be 300 now save it now we'll go to the browser and reload the page and see the output as you can see here there are two pages and by using css or some attribute of frame tag we can hide the border or we can just skip it so this way we can do this question and this is very important for practical examination and uh, what what i have did i am showing you now first uh, you will have to create two pages two html pages the first page will create list.html and the command is this one i am opening it here the code for the list page is this one then you will create one more page that page will contain table information the table tag will be this one so side by side i am showing this is for list this is for table and i can make it a smaller also so that you can see all the tag together So this one is list paste and this one is table page okay and one more page the main page where will contain the frame information and this is the main page frame page so total three pages you will create and you will save all the three pages after that you will open the main page then only you can see all the three pages together if you are going to open this list or table tag suppose i am opening the table page then I can see only the table and if I open the list page then I can see only the list but if I open the frame page I can see all the three pages so this way you can do this question If you find any difficulties, if you find any problem during practical and if you have any doubt then you can ask me in our telegram group. This is our group ID. We are so I am showing here. This is our group. Here you can discuss your problems. You can discuss question answers. So thank you for watching. See you in a new video. Till then take care and bye.